Welcome back to Lutz TV, me, Sam Phillips, and John Byron, come manager, Billy Payton. Billy, thanks for joining us. I had a perfect Christmas present there, really. Three points on the road with a 1 0 victory. How do you feel directly after that one? Really pleased that we managed to uh, pick three points up, uh, bounce back from a disappointing result and performance against City Liverpool. But we knew we'd come in here and uh, watch them, a very direct physical team. So, you know, the questions were to the players can you stand up and, and deal with that? And I felt we did. Felt that we we utilised the space uh, and moved the ball a lot quickly. I thought the goal was worked magnificently. Uh, it really got me excited. Yeah, defensive stability has been something we've really been built on this year. A couple of changes in the back line today. Peter Wiley out to right back and new boy Sam Wilson in in the back four. There, how was your performance on him? Big Sam was was tremendous. You know, I've watched him all last season. We've always kept tabs on him and sent a half that. I really liked. Uh, it was a tough decision. It could have been a, you know, I've ch I changed shape, I changed personnel up until the final minutes of me, me team selection. Uh, Sam's done ever so well. Sam Barry done ever so well for us, and and so was Peter. So I just felt that it was a bit more. Uh, I wanted a bit more secure as a back four. Didn't want much uh, runners going forward, certainly from deep and keeping us open because that's how. Chase Town hit us last time and City Liverpool capitalised on that. So keep a solid back four. Uh, dropped early down with Jax um, and told them to be a bit more disciplined as a two. And as we, we did, I say we were brave enough with the ball, we were fine the pockets, getting Lynchy into those little half spaces and he was I thought he was brilliant today. And then Will and Mosley, you know, obviously wasn't the, the say they have any impact but the work rate of them was was key especially out of possession and ollie he's a uh, sometimes it's hard when you're a lone striker to do a lot of work you can take all the knocks for the team but being a platform for us but i felt he should have scored yeah now we move on to boxing day against high flying prescott cables came from 2-0 down to beat mosley today how did we go into that one into what could be the biggest game of the season so far. It certainly is. They're flying, uh, and rightly so. They, you know, they're a well-organised team, and they work ever so hard for each other. So it'll be uh, another difficult game for us. But we've got a home. Uh, hopefully, Boxing Day, we can put a performance uh, like we have been against the teams in and around the playoffs. Uh, I've said to the subs, there, there will be changes. We've seen the last sort of 10 minutes, players are a bit laggy. So I've got decisions to make. Yeah, now we've seen in the professional game this week, managers calling for atmosphere to be built in their stadiums. If you could give the, the fans a, a rally cry for Boxing Day, what would you say to them? Yes, there's not many, there's not much I do usually say about fans because the fans, they travel today in numbers and, you know, I could hear them uh, behind the goal, hear them always at home. When we are a bit flat, sometimes you can be the 12th man to get us going uh, with the singing and with the passion that you, you, you bring. Yeah, perfect. Well, thanks for joining us, Bill. Have a good Christmas and we'll speak to you on Boxing Day. You too. And I say, I want to say again, massive thank you for the fans for travelling this distance to support the lads. Uh, you know, your support never goes unnoticed. I hope they have a, a fantastic Christmas themselves.